हेलो एवरीवन आई एम सिद्धांत टुडे आई विल डिस्कस द सम शॉर्टकट यू कैन यूज विद द हेल्प ऑफ योर कैलकुलेटर वट एवर कैलकुलेटर यू हैव बीन प्रोवाइडेड फॉर द एग्जामिनेशन स्पेशली द जे आई बी एंड सी आई बी यू कैन यूटिलाइज दैट कैलकुलेटर टू कैलकुलेट द थिंग्स विच आर ओनली बी कैलकुलेटेड बाई द साइंटिफिक कैलकुलेटर्स फाइन द पावर ऑफ समथिंग और यू हैव टू फाइन द रूट ऑफ समथिंग so in this uh session i will discuss the process to find the powers as well as the under root to to the power to any power we can find through the calculator so taking the example uh, in the questions of annuity and depreciation you you will find like this that the rate is given and the power is given 5 or 1 by 10 to the power 1 by 5 let's take these two examples if we take the first one first one is easy if the power is not in fraction it's an integer value so how could we find it it's it's nothing but 1.10 to the power 5 we can find it by with the help of calculator you have to type 1.10 multiplied and whatever the power is given you have to Press equal to less uh, one less than the power of this. For example, here the power is five. You have to take, you have to write one point one zero first. Then you have to press multiplication sign. Then you have to press equal to the uh, uh, number of times given minus one. So you have to press equal to four times. Okay, one, two, three, four. So you will get one point. Six one zero five one as an answer, but here one thing is very important. If you solve the questions in the examination for J I B or C I B or let's say any exam, then at least find up to the four digit because there might be a chance that in the option they will give a very close uh, options to each other. So you cannot test it out by having taking after. a uh, decimal uh, two digit after decimal so i would uh, recommend you to take four digit after the decimal so next we will see how we can find this 1.10 to the power 1 by 5 so it's 1.10 to the power 1 by 5 so you have to press 1.10 first then you have to press square root 12 times 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 okay then you have to subtract 1 then you have to divide by the denominator which is given the fraction so 5 then you have to plus 1 then you have to press multiply equal to 12 times 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 so this would be our answer so if you practice four to five questions from both of these then you will have a command over the calculator and you can easily solve in the examination as well that's it thank you so that's it in the calculator part